NBC 26. Meteorologist Brian Nisnanski. All right, the current time is 610. We'll start you off with a couple pictures here. This one from NBC 26 weather team member Tanner. He took this shot on the north end of Lake Winnebago Saturday evening when we had some thunderstorms rumbling through the area. Thankfully, no severe weather. Once again, the quiet, severe weather season continues. Now, Sunday, we saw a lot more sun, and Lance took this picture right around Reedsville. Some Sunday clear skies into the evening, a beautiful sunset. Now, they sent those pictures via I Contribute at NBC26.com. 54 degrees, the current temperature in Appleton, 51 now in Green Bay. Temperatures already starting to warm up with the sun rising above. It's going to be another beautiful day today. Nice weather continues. A few more clouds in the forecast than yesterday, but overall still very nice. Next chance of rain won't be until Thursday. There's quite a bit of rain to the west of us across Nebraska and Kansas. This area of low pressure you see to the west is eventually going to dive south of us. For us, we'll have high pressure that will protect us from any rain that tries to move in here uh, from the west. Maybe a few isolated showers across northwestern and north central Wisconsin. For us, we'll have partly to mostly sunny skies through the day on Tuesday. More of the same. This area of low pressure actually dives way south of the area, but watch it. Work its way a little bit farther north here as we head on into Wednesday. So Wednesday, maybe a few more clouds, and by Thursday, uh, we could have a chance of a shower or storm. All right, 68 degrees by noon, 71 degrees by 5 o'clock. And here's your 10-day forecast, 75 on Tuesday, 77 Wednesday, 80 on Thursday. Friday, 77, 78 degrees on Saturday. Right now, it looks like next weekend is shaping up to be beautiful and just in time for the bell and run. Perfect conditions, low humidity, temperatures ranging from the 50s in the morning to the 70s by the afternoon. Good thing with the warmer weather, our smoker works a lot better in summertime than yeah. in winter. We got some ribs in there yesterday. You did. Oh, how, long so did you, how long did you cook them for? Five hours. Long time to wait for food. Yeah, you should do. I, I would say you do them around eight or nine hours. See, I was I was complaining, and Ryan kept saying they're going to get more tender, and I said mm -mm. I want them out of there because I wanted to be able to taste them before my early bedtime. I'm sure they were delicious. They were good. Yeah. They were good. All right, coming up next.